there, coffee lovers. My name is Nick, and today I'm going to share hints from the gameplay of Espresso Tycoon with you. So grab your coffee, sit down, and let's dive right in. The first thing you see in the mission is a brand editor. Choose the name of your coffee shop, the logo, color, and font of the name of your brand. Check your money balance in the top bar, and your current rating points. They indicate the popularity of your coffee shop. The UI shows you also other helpful numbers, like sold coffees, customers inside the coffee shop, or style points. The money multiplier is a very important feature. It will help you get rich faster. The more style points you have, the greater your money multiplier is. How does it work? The price of each coffee sold will be multiplied by the current value of the money multiplier. Speaking of the deco items, decorating is one of the most interesting parts of the gameplay. Change the walls and floors, and choose some details to finish up the decor. Sometimes, you'll need to fix tables and chairs that are being used often by your customers. You will also have to water your plants or clean up the rubbish inside the coffee shop. But don't worry, if you have enough money, you can hire handymen and cleaners who will take care of that for you. Not all of the deco items or ingredients are unlocked at the beginning of the game. With the research window, you can decide how much money you want to invest in the research process and set up which categories of items you want to unlock and use first. Note that if you have snacks, you can sell them to your customers. Prepare the menu for your customers. Choose the recipes and set the price. Just be careful not to charge too much, otherwise your customers will get mad and stop buying your coffee. You can also create your own unique coffee recipe in the 3D Coffee Editor. Start with choosing a cup, then add some ingredients. While creating your coffee, observe the market research bars. Each social group has different preferences, and it's not easy to make a coffee recipe loved by everyone. If you want your coffee to be extra special, top it off with some latte art. You need to have steamed milk or foam as a top layer in your recipe. Add toppings to make your coffee more attractive. See the summary to check the drink's capacity, calories, and allergens. More fancy coffees may be tempting, but they often take longer to make, so check their preparation time. To make and sell coffee to your customers, you'll need to have the right supplies on hand, or rather in a cup. Hover the cursor on the coffee recipe, and check the highlighted ones to see if you need to order some additional supplies. There are different supply providers, with different quality and prices. In the beginning, you may go for the cheaper option, but over time, your customers will expect better quality. You can always set the priority of the provider you want to use for a given supply. The next thing is clicking the order button. Set the number of packages, and choose the delivery type. You can wait a few in-game hours or choose an instant delivery. It'll be quick but expensive. When the order is delivered, you need to pick up the package by clicking on it. Upgrading your coffee machine brings some great benefits. It'll help you make some new coffee recipes and hire more baristas, if your coffee machine has enough slots for them. Check also the speed of the coffee machine, quality, and, of course, the price. You need some employees to run a coffee shop. Check their skills, salary, and shift duration. Note that the customers will give you positive or negative reviews depending on your barista's skills. You can train your employees, but it will cost and take time. After hiring employees, you'll need to set their schedules. Check their preferred working hours. Don't hire too many people so they don't spend too much time on break. Let's talk about the customers. There are eight different social groups. Each has its own preferences. Customers will review aspects like your menu, deco style, prices, coffee quality, music, cleanliness, and employees' skills. The more positive reviews you have, the more rating points you get. Looking to increase traffic to your coffee shop? Try running a marketing campaign. Select the target social groups and the type of media. The customers attracted by the campaign will be highlighted, so you'll notice them. You really will. Check the finances window to see the profit and loss table for the last few days. If you want to invest more money than you have available, you can take out some loans, but you'll have to pay interest to the bank. If your money balance goes below zero dollars, you'll get a warning about the possibility of bankruptcy. A bathroom is a must-have in any decent cafe. Customers will notice its absence, believe me. Get the right coffee shop level and earn some money to unlock it. Don't forget to order some soap and toilet paper. The economy in Espresso Tycoon is super complex, but don't worry, you won't get overwhelmed. 
The number of your tasks will increase as your coffee shop level goes up. When you're doing well, you'll get the next golden bean, which not only gives you some cash, but also unlocks new possibilities. That's it! Get ready to build your successful coffee business!